Alright, what's going on you guys? Today we are flying in a lake in South Carolina, Lexington. It is currently like June 12th or something like that. I don't know. Um, but yeah, this is one of my first videos I'm recording. Really nice. Getting a little bit of wind. They got some beautiful houses. Alright, we're getting a strong wind warning. I am right there where the boat docks are. You gotta turn. I'm right there where that parking lot is. Alright, weak signal. It's just a tiny bit windy. I don't want to go too far away. Maybe explore over here a bit. I don't know, but I am pretty far away. Anyway, it is really pretty out here. I don't know how far out I want to go. But this is doing pretty well. I said I could only fly up to like 33 feet. Um, I'll show all that stuff on the screen while I'm flying. But uh, I'm at 157 and I only got one wind warning. Doesn't feel that high. But yeah. It's really beautiful out right now. It's like 11 a.m. And this lake is huge. It's like over 300 miles of absolute shore and it's about 30 miles in distance so can't go that far with this but oh it's just beautiful so nice out there's a lot of boats and jet skis here's one but I'm over half a mile away but this this lake is just so big so pretty Ooh, now we're getting another strong wind warning let's look at all these boats wow sorry if my transitions are just a tad bit shaky uh, this is my first video actually recording and planning out and making this a video. I've posted some other stuff, but nothing like this. We actually planned it out. I'm going to start coming back because we are getting stronger wind warnings. But this is beautiful. Here, we'll fly over to this dam. This is one of the largest dams in the world. When it opened, it was like... The largest, I'm pretty sure. I want to go up to at least 150 feet. Okay, now we're there. And the wind's picking up again. But this dam is huge. I mean, there's a power plant over here. And this big wall, but... This thing is, look how long this is. If I take it over this way. I think I'm going to turn just here and go down the shore to where I'm, I'm located. But we're getting a strong wind warning, so I don't want to, I want to be careful, but I don't, I don't want to bring it all the way down because we are above water right now. But this is my first true flight above the water. I don't know when this is going to be posted, but um, this is getting me ready for um, going to the beach for sure. So I'm over here where the gap in the trees are, sitting at this nice picnic area, right by this parking lot. But I'll fly back over here because there's some, there's a cool little inlet. There's this nice big sailboat in the top corner of the screen. This is such a nice area.
got some really nice really nice dock and this park is just beautiful and we're getting another strong one warning I'm sitting down where those pavilions are but uh, look at these a little inlet there's some huge 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 houses over here I can fly over here I think I'm gonna go across this little inlet over here I just wish it wasn't as windy gain some altitude so you guys could see it is it is beautiful around here I don't know if I'm allowed to fly at this park I think I am over on the other side I know you're not allowed but over here there weren't any restrictions but you can just see how massive this lake is so big I mean, it just goes on as far as you can see. I mean, look at all these, look at all these private docks and look at that huge house. It's just beautiful, beautiful area. But this inlet is really nice. It's really pretty. What's that in the middle of the water? There's like three paddle boats in a row. These houses are all so big. Looks like they're being pulled by one big boat. Yeah, I don't know what those are. There's so many paddle boats out here. And sailboats. Look at all these docks. I wonder if they're all private. I mean, look at all these. There's at least like five or six little mini sailboat thingies this is super cool this would be such a nice place to do a range test but just a little scared with the wind I don't want to lose this thing yet this is so beautiful What's this red rock work over here? All right, we're getting a tiny bit more wind. That's a pretty sailboat. I love the blue. Hmm. Some waves, it looks like. Look at those big brown buildings. I wonder if those are like individual houses or apartments or complexes or something. This is such a beautiful day. Such a nice day to fly. This is our last day in Lexington. And then tomorrow we go to Myrtle Beach. Can't wait to get some more drone shots there. But yeah, this is one of the first videos that I'm recording for Just Fly. Pretty neat. Okay, we're losing some connection. I think I'm going to turn her. I have no idea what that is. Over here. It's red. Looks nice. Yeah, but this is just one of the first videos on Just Fly, so it's pretty neat. So there's the docks where they're fishing. I'm about 200 feet away from where those are. But it is so pretty. Now oh, here comes the speedboat. He'll be on screen in a second. There he is. Hmm. That's so neat. Ah, we're getting some some wind. I wonder how much it's fighting it out there. Since it has a gimbal, you can't really tell since it's all ultra smooth. It looks like there's no wind, but I'm sure this little thing's fighting it. I 
I do have the Mavic Mini and I've had it for about two weeks. So pretty awesome. I want to fly. So if that's the docks, we can fly over that way more. How long have I been flying? 12 minutes. Not bad. I have 10 minutes left. I don't know if we'll use all of that. I got a good video. I know some people find this really interesting, but when videos go on for like 20 minutes and stuff, sometimes this is just some, some relaxing content that I'm making. Not really meant to be an eye catcher. I mean, I watch this stuff just to relax. I, I enjoy this. I love drone flying. And I know there's people out there who do too. <laughs> but, yeah. Now it looks like we have this private marina back here. I won't fly over it, but I'll fly near it. I think there is an airport nearby, but it's like 15 miles away. But I'm 120 feet in the air right now, so I would not affect any airplanes. So here's that marina. That looks really pretty. Look how many boats there are. These all look like sailboats too. Maybe not. I don't know what those long pole things are. It's hard to see through my phone. That's a nice boat. I like that boat. That's out almost directly in front of me. And then here we got some jet skis. We've been keeping a good 15 to 17 miles an hour. That's nice. Just in primary mode. That'd be so much fun to rent a jet ski. I mean, look at this lake. It doesn't even look like a lake. It's so much bigger in person, but... I mean, it is so big. You get a better view from over on the other side. Look at these guys. That's a cool boat. But kind of neat. The farthest I got was like half a mile-ish. I want to take it up just a little more. It's just a tiny bit windy. But we're at 35%, so I'm not going to go too far. This house right here, in the middle of the screen right now, that first house on land, the biggest, most gorgeous thing in the world. You can't, there's, this does not describe how nice it looks. All right, we got some low battery. We're at 34%, so once I show you guys this house, I'll fly back. But, oh my gosh, this thing, three floors. Just three main floors. I don't know if it has a basement or not. All right, getting a little bit of a strong wind warning. Look at that thing. That is so beautiful. There's some awesome neighborhoods around here that have just beautiful houses. I mean, this whole entire line of private lake houses, that's awesome. That's so pretty. I'm getting a little bit of choppiness with my phone. Hope it's not like that on the recording. All right, we're just a tad bit further away than I thought. We can make it back in five minutes for sure. It'll push just a tiny bit, but we're at 29%. We got seven minutes left. All right, we're just getting a tiny bit of wind. Not gonna hit return to home. I'm around a lot of people. I don't want to draw attention to myself again because I think I'm allowed to fly drones here, but I'm I'm not sure. It's tiny, and I did not submit a flight. I I haven't set that up on the app yet. On the 
Um, I don't know what app it's called. I forget. But that's going to bother me. I'll just put it up on screen, but I'm not registered yet. Um, I have not took the time to do that. I'm waiting until I go to a more crowded, more popular place. All right, we're just getting a strong wind warning. And I'm bringing her home. But there's a boat launch around here. I don't know if you guys can hear all that stuff. Okay. Can't see the drone yet. But I'm by that really tiny tree. Right by those steps. So I'll bring it down. I'm 60 feet in the air and we're getting a strong wind warning. Okay. Here's where we have to do a little more precise flying. Right, I'm going to put it in C mode. And there's my drone. And there I am in the bright green shirt. Alright, we got some power lines. That's just a tiny bit scary. But here we got a straight shot. Bring it down. All right, now I'm getting that low battery. We made it just that. Thank you guys for watching. Leave a like if you want and keep it your eyes. All right. I'll catch you guys in the next one.